Our philosophy is based around our mission of innovate, engage and inspire. We think about the innovation as truly personalised learning. We look to engage through what we call powerful partnerships where we concentrate on the relationship between the learner, the teacher and the wider community so that they become what we would call lifelong and empowered learners. The interaction between the two schools is critical in making this whole environment between the primary and secondary school successful. We've got our students mentoring the students from the primary school. There's a program that's run in both schools where kids are often interest area workshops. So across the schools we're growing that partnership where the students can benefit from our teachers, their teachers and make the most of their learning opportunities. My view of a PPP is that for a principal who likes engaging and learning with students, it's the best thing that could possibly happen. Not having to manage anything to do with property, but to be able to focus on teaching and learning solely has been greatly beneficial. I've been able to concentrate almost entirely on building the culture of the school, uh, developing relationships amongst staff, making sure we've got the pedagogy right, and then interacting with the community and our prospective students. I wouldn't have been able to do that if I also had to manage the build. The best thing about being in a modern learning environment and having architecture like we do is that it allows for a number of things. One of them is deprivatises practice. So it's very obvious what's going on both for the students and for the teachers and for me being able to wander around the learning spaces. It also allows for really flexible learning spaces to take place. So we can have students doing music next to students who are doing art, next to students who are doing writing, next to students who might be involved in a workshop run by a teacher. They need to learn how to self-manage and self-direct. They need to learn how to organise. All of those skills that often a single cell classroom doesn't offer. It's been outstanding doing our establishment work and watching a community grow and get established around us and we can move forward with our kids knowing that we have an opportunity to be the real beating heart of a new community. Mm -hmm.